Hey guys, welcome back to SUP Tales. And in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how I created the school abstract tunnel in cinema. So, without wasting any time, let's get started. As you can see here, I have already created few objects and some materials. Okay, so we need one big torus for a tunnel. So go here and select this torus. Let's change the ring radius around 250. Ring segments I can take around 90 because pipe. Let's make it 40. And pipe segments also 40. Okay, so that's our torus, which is our tunnel. And now let's create one camera. Okay, let's go inside tunnel. Yeah. Okay, now click on this camera icon. Okay, click on this box. And now just let's change some parameters over here. So let's change this focal length for 15 or maybe 12. Okay, now let's uh, animate this camera. So select this camera and press Option or Alt G to group it. Now right click, go to animation tags. Okay. First, we need to create one spline. So go back to our normal view, which is this. Okay, let's create one circle as a path. So circle, change this to XC, go to top view and increase the radius around 250. Okay. Now select this null, right click, go to animation tags and select this align to spline. Okay, this will help us to animate our camera. So select this tag and drag and drop this circle inside the spline path here. Okay, now check this tangential, go to camera view okay now we are going to animate this position okay before that increase the timeline so i check 400 now go back to frame zero add a keyframe go back to 400 and make it 99 so as our animation is loopable so i don't want any halt in between so 0 and 99 now right click on position go to animation and inside f curve see our graph is like that we don't want we want linear okay so great now let's add one cloner object and Select all these objects and put inside the cloner. Okay, now select this cloner and go here inside the mode instead of linear, make it object. And our object is this torus, which is this. So drag and drop this torus inside the object. So you see, let's play this. So you will see the objects are on here. Okay. So these are very less. Let's increase the count. So let's make it around 70. Okay. Go back to frame zero. And then you will get this kind of abstract tunnel okay 
now let's add some spheres also in between so go to here and add one sphere radius i take around one again select this cloner so and put that sphere inside the cloner and again go to mode instead of linear select object and then put that torus inside the object now one little change instead of inside the distribution instead of surface we are going to change this to volume and let's increase the volume okay now just make few copies of the sphere so we can add different material on it okay so as you can see here i have some already materials some neon kind of materials now let's add this material to these spheres like that yes and this black material for the tunnel so now if you hit the render we will get something like this go to setting and inside this instead of geometry make it best If you want to increase these objects, you can simply go select the clone of and you can increase the count also by like that. And if you want to change the rotation or anything, select the clone of, go here inside the mobular, inside the effector, there is a random. Okay, so select this random uncheck the position and check rotation now you can randomize the rotation that and if you play now you will get this kind of animation now i quickly take one render and i'll see you in after effects Okay, now quickly add some brightness to it. Great. I hope you like this tutorial. Subscribe Spitals and don't forget to hit the like button. Thank you.